Hi everybody, I'm Jeff Smith, a broker with Capitol Hill Windermere, standing on 22nd Avenue East in the beautiful community of Montlake. I had a listing just up the street uh, earlier this year and got to know the neighbors on this street and they're very proud of 22nd Avenue East. In fact, everybody I talked to thought that this was the best street in Montlake. Uh, I'm here to share with you a new listing, a unique listing here in Montlake. So the listing is at 2461 22nd Avenue East, and it is a 1920s cottage. There were quite a few of these built in Montlake, and this is one of the only ones left standing. Like many of these cottages that were built at the turn of the century, it's on a relatively small lot, only 1,440 square feet, but enough for you to get your, your, your green thumb on. The cottage has been a rental for the past 29 years, and the most recent renter lived here for 14 years. He absolutely loved it. It is being sold as is, with the seller doing no repairs. Come on in. Welcome, everybody. This is 450 square feet, Montlake 100-year-old cottage. Like I said, there are a lot of original details, like the beamed ceiling, also, the fur floors that run throughout the living room and also uh, the bedroom. There's a lot of light in the main living area. You've got the original brick fireplace, wood-burning fireplace, still works. And it's framed on either side by these cute little doors that open up out onto the patio above the single-car garage. The bedroom is not huge, but you could easily fit a full-size bed in here, maybe a queen-size and we have a couple of closet areas and some built-in cabinetry. This is the exit to the backyard and steps down into the basement. Uh, the bathroom is over here. We'll show that to you in a little bit. There is a refrigerator behind this wall, but this is the original ice box in this 100-year-old home. It actually has an outside um, entrance where the ice man could come and fill this up with ice, and this is where you kept your cold things which indicates this house may have been built before there was electricity. As my friend Sally Welch likes to say, who's been in the business for 36 years, this is a, a space saver kitchen, but it's got everything you need, refrigerator, stove, double sink, original cabinetry, and a 100-year-old icebox. The full bath is off the back side of the cottage. Uh, it has a tub, shower, toilet, and sink all you could possibly want. I'm pretty sure the garage is the original garage with the house. So it's quite possible 100 years ago you'd see a Model T parked in here. It's a, a good decent size garage uh, for your Prius, your Tesla, whatever you might want to put in here to keep safe. Come on into the basement. Uh, the basement is also 450 square feet. It's all unfinished. There is a newer hot water tank. There's a set of stairs off the back of the house, the back of the kitchen, that leads down to the basement. Uh, there's the door to those stairs. There is a washer and dryer that conveys with the property. It's possible that if the basement were excavated that you could put another 450 square feet of finished space down here. You can see though, at present, I'm six foot tall, the ceiling height is a little on the low side. Well, that's the Montlake Cottage, 450 finished square feet on the main floor, 450 unfinished feet in the basement, waiting perhaps to be finished. Uh, because the lot is the size it is, it would not be possible to tear this down and build something else. However, with the house already on the lot, you could remodel, go up possibly another story, add another 450 square feet and include a rooftop deck that might possibly have some really nice views out there. We're on the market at $495,000 and remember again it's being sold as is. My telephone number is on the screen. If you have questions give me a call. If you're working with a broker have them give me a call. We'd be glad to help you in any way we can.